I work out every day. But I, but I had to, I, I had no choice because, uh, you know, the doctors were telling me I was slowly, well, not slowly, killing myself. Prepare to dive into the electrifying world of Ozzy Osbourne, the legendary Prince of Darkness, who redefined heavy metal as Black Sabbath's frontman and achieved solo stardom with hits like Crazy Train. His distinctive voice and wild stage antics have earned him multiple Grammy Awards, including Best Rock Album for Patient No. 9 in 2023. Despite health challenges, including Parkinson's disease and a recent spinal surgery, Ozzy remains a resilient force, recently making a rare public appearance to connect with fans. Join us as we explore the life of this iconic rock figure, whose unyielding spirit continues to captivate audiences worldwide. However, before Ozzy took the music world by storm, his formative years shaped him in ways that many never realized. Early Life Born on December 3, 1948, in Birmingham, England, John Michael Ozzy Osbourne emerged from humble beginnings to become a titan of heavy metal. Growing up in the working-class district of Aston, he was one of six children in a modest household. His father, Jack Osborne, toiled as a toolmaker on night shifts, while his mother, Lillian, assembled car components during the day. Ozzy's early education was marked by challenges. He grappled with dyslexia and attention deficit disorder, which made traditional schooling difficult. At 15, he left school and undertook various low-paying jobs, including stints as a laborer, plumber, and apprentice toolmaker. A brush with the law led to a brief imprisonment for burglary, a period that profoundly impacted his outlook on life. Despite these hurdles, music became Ozzy's sanctuary. He was particularly inspired by the Beatles, whose groundbreaking sound ignited his passion for music. In 1967, he formed his first band, Rare Breed, with bassist Geezer Butler. Although the band dissolved after only two performances, this collaboration laid the groundwork for future endeavors. Ozzy's path took a pivotal turn when he teamed up with guitarist Tony Iommi and drummer Bill Ward to form the band Earth, which was later renamed Black Sabbath in 1969. This ensemble would go on to pioneer the heavy metal genre, with Ozzy's distinctive vocals and stage presence playing a central role in their success. Throughout his journey, Ozzy was influenced and supported by key figures. His father, Jack, demonstrated unwavering support. Notably, he crafted large crosses for each member of Black Sabbath to wear, offering protection against perceived curses from occult groups. Additionally, guitarist Randy Rhodes, who joined Ozzy's solo band in the early 1980s, was instrumental in shaping his post-Black Sabbath sound, bringing a blend of classical and metal influences that defined albums like Blizzard of Oz. Yet, as he navigated the challenges of his youth, Ozzy was just beginning a journey that would revolutionize heavy metal. Career and Success Ozzy Osbourne's career is a testament to his enduring influence in the music industry. Rising to prominence in the 1970s as the frontman of Black Sabbath, he played a pivotal role in shaping the heavy metal genre. The band's early albums, such as Paranoid and Master of Reality, are considered seminal works that laid the foundation for heavy metal music. After parting ways with Black Sabbath in 1979, Ozzy embarked on a successful solo career. His debut solo album, Blizzard of Oz, 1980, featured the hit single Crazy Train, which became one of his signature songs. The album's success solidified his status as a solo artist and showcased his ability to innovate within the genre. Throughout his career, Ozzy has received numerous accolades. He was inducted into the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame twice, first in 2006 as a member of Black Sabbath and again in 2024 as a solo artist. In 2023, he won the Grammy Award for Best Rock Album for Patient No. 9, further cementing his legacy. Beyond his musical achievements, Ozzy's cultural impact is significant. His distinctive voice, stage presence, and persona have made him an icon in popular culture. The reality TV show The Osbournes, which aired in the early 2000s, offered a glimpse into his personal life and introduced him to a broader audience. Ozzy's influence extends beyond music. He has inspired countless artists and continues to be a prominent figure in the entertainment industry. 
His resilience and ability to adapt have ensured his relevance across decades, making him a true legend in the world of rock and metal. But Ozzy's impact wasn't only musical, it also turned into a financial powerhouse as he crafted his legacy. Income and Net Worth Ozzy Osbourne boasts an estimated net worth of $220 million as of 2024. As the frontman of Black Sabbath and a successful solo artist, Ozzy has sold over 100 million albums worldwide. His solo debut, Blizzard of Oz, alone contributed significantly to his earnings, with millions of copies sold globally. The reality show, The Osbournes, which aired from 2002 to 2005, offered a lucrative income stream. In its second season, each family member reportedly earned $5 million, totaling $20 million for the family. Launched in 1996, this annual music festival became a financial juggernaut. By 2004, OzFest had grossed over $100 million and sold more than 5 million tickets. Ozzy's brand extends to merchandise sales, including clothing and collectibles, contributing an estimated $50 million to his wealth. Additionally, endorsements with brands like Guitar Hero and Samsung have bolstered his income. Ozzy and his wife, Sharon, have invested in real estate, including a $10 million home in Beverly Hills, adding to their asset portfolio. Despite health challenges, Ozzy continues to earn through royalties, merchandise sales, and media appearances, ensuring his legacy endures both culturally and financially. However, beyond the earnings and acclaim, there's much more to discover about Ozzy's unique and intriguing lifestyle. Lifestyle Insights Ozzy Osbourne is a man of many facets beyond his iconic status in heavy metal. His life is a tapestry woven with intriguing hobbies, heartfelt philanthropy, and a penchant for the unconventional. Despite his rock and roll persona, Ozzy has a surprising passion for gardening. He finds solace in tending to his garden, a hobby that offers a stark contrast to his onstage antics. Additionally, he's an avid collector of art with a particular fondness for contemporary pieces that adorn his homes. Ozzy and his wife, Sharon, have a penchant for the English countryside. They often retreat to their estate in Buckinghamshire, seeking tranquility away from the limelight. Their love for the UK countryside is so profound that they announced plans to return to England permanently, citing a desire to escape the tumultuous climate of the United States. Ozzy's philanthropic efforts are as dynamic as his music career. He has supported numerous charities, including the Elton John AIDS Foundation, Save the Children, and the Prince's Trust. Notably, he donated the damages he received from a libel case to his wife's charity, the Sharon Osborne Colon Cancer Program. Ozzy's career is peppered with controversies that have become legendary. In 1982, he infamously bit the head off a bat during a concert, a moment that has become a part of rock folklore. Another notable incident was his arrest in San Antonio, Texas, for urinating on a cenotaph near the Alamo, leading to a decade-long ban from the city. Ozzy has a taste for traditional English fare, with a particular fondness for shepherd's pie and roast dinners. While not an avid sports fan, he has expressed admiration for boxing, appreciating the discipline and resilience it requires. Known for his gothic-inspired wardrobe, Ozzy favors black clothing, leather jackets, and his signature round sunglasses. Beyond heavy metal, he has a deep appreciation for the Beatles, crediting them as a significant influence on his musical career. Ozzy has enjoyed watching The Walking Dead, drawn to its intense storytelling and complex characters. He has expressed admiration for classic horror films, with The Exorcist being a particular favorite. Ozzy has a penchant for biographies, often reading about the lives of other musicians and historical figures. True to his persona, black remains his favorite color, reflecting his enduring Gothic style. A devoted animal lover, Ozzy has had numerous pets over the years. He recently mourned the loss of his beloved Pomeranian, Rocky, who had been by his side for 15 years. The Osborne family continues to open their home to rescue animals, showcasing their commitment to animal welfare. Ozzy has an impressive collection of crucifixes, a nod to his stage persona and personal beliefs. He also cherishes sentimental possessions, including gifts from fans and memorabilia from his extensive career. 
His jewelry collection is notable, featuring custom-made pieces that complement his distinctive style. In essence, Ozzy Osbourne's lifestyle is a blend of rock and roll excess, heartfelt philanthropy, and personal passions that paint a picture of a man who is as complex as he is legendary. Nevertheless, Ozzy's life wouldn't be complete without the relationships and friendships that supported and influenced his journey. Relationships and Connections In 1971, Ozzy married Thelma Riley, with whom he had two children, Jessica and Louis Osborne. He also adopted Thelma's son, Elliot Kingsley. However, the marriage was tumultuous, strained by Ozzy's rising fame and substance abuse, leading to their divorce in 1982. Shortly after, Ozzy wed Sharon Arden on July 4, 1982, in Hawaii. Their union has been both passionate and challenging, enduring publicized infidelities and personal struggles. Despite these hurdles, their bond remains strong, with Sharon often describing their relationship as unbreakable. Ozzy and Sharon have three children, Amy Osborne. Born in 1983, Amy chose a life away from the family's reality TV fame, focusing on her music career under the moniker A.R.O. Kelly Osborne. Born in 1984, Kelly gained prominence through The Osborne's reality show and has since pursued careers in music, fashion, and television. Jack Osborne. Born in 1985, Jack also starred in the family's reality show and has become a television personality and producer. Ozzy is one of six children. He has three older sisters, Jean, Iris, and Jillian, and two younger brothers, Paul and Tony. Growing up in a modest household in Birmingham, England, the Osborne siblings shared a close-knit upbringing. Throughout his career, Ozzy has formed notable friendships within the music industry. His bond with guitarist Randy Rhodes was particularly significant. Rhodes' innovative playing greatly influenced Ozzy's early solo work. Additionally, his camaraderie with fellow Black Sabbath members, especially Tony Iommi, has been a cornerstone of his musical journey. But relationships are just part of his story, as Ozzy's home life also reflects his remarkable career and personality. Real Estate In the early 2000s, Ozzy and Sharon Osbourne resided in a sprawling estate in Hidden Hills, California. This 10,000-square-foot mansion, featured in their reality show, The Osbournes, became emblematic of their eccentric lifestyle. The property boasted seven bedrooms, a recording studio, and a pool adorned with gothic accents. In 2013, they sold this iconic home to singer Jessica Simpson for $11.5 million. Post Hidden Hills, the Osbournes acquired a Mediterranean-style villa in Beverly Hills. This 11,000-square-foot residence featured a grand staircase, multiple fireplaces, and a lushly landscaped backyard complete with a grotto-like pool. The home exuded old Hollywood charm, aligning with the couple's eclectic taste. In 2015, the Osbournes purchased a historic 1929 Mediterranean Revival Mansion in Los Angeles' Hancock Park neighborhood for approximately $12 million. Spanning 11,500 square feet, the estate includes six bedrooms, 11 bathrooms, and a guest apartment above the garage. The couple undertook extensive renovations, blending modern amenities with the home's original character. In 2022, they listed the property for $18 million, reflecting its enhanced value. Embracing their British roots, the Osbournes own a grade two listed mansion in Jordan's Buckinghamshire. Known as Welder's House, this historic estate offers a serene countryside retreat. As mentioned in 2022, they announced plans to return to the UK citing a desire to escape the tumultuous climate of the United States. Yet the properties he's called home only begin to capture his tastes. Ozzy's love for powerful vehicles is an extension of his rock persona. Vehicles and Cars Ozzy's car collection has featured some of the most coveted models in the automotive world. He has been known to own a Lamborghini Diablo, a high-performance Italian supercar that epitomizes speed and luxury. Additionally, his garage has housed a Rolls-Royce Phantom, reflecting his penchant for classic British elegance. A Ferrari F40, renowned for its sleek design and powerful engine, has also been part of his collection. 
these vehicles collectively underscore his appreciation for both performance and style. Beyond cars, Ozzy's passion extends to motorcycles. He has owned a custom-built chopper crafted by Count's Customs, featuring a distinctive cross-shaped gas tank and alligator-hide solo seat, embodying his unique aesthetic. Additionally, he has been associated with a Yamaha Banshee 350cc quad bike, which he famously crashed in 2003, leading to significant injuries. Still, Ozzy's love for fast cars and bikes is just one piece of his current status as a music legend and cultural icon. Current Lifestyle As of November 2024, Ozzy Osbourne, the indomitable Prince of Darkness, continues to make headlines with his enduring influence in the music industry and personal milestones. Ozzy has faced significant health challenges in recent years, including a spinal injury from a 2019 fall and a Parkinson's disease diagnosis. In September 2023, he underwent what he described as his final spinal surgery, expressing relief at the prospect of no further operations. Despite these hurdles, Ozzy remains resilient, focusing on recovery and spending quality time with his family. In October 2024, Ozzy was honored with a second induction into the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame, this time as a solo artist. The ceremony featured tributes from fellow musicians, underscoring his lasting impact on rock music. Demonstrating his cultural significance, Ozzy collaborated with Aston Villa and Adidas in October 2024 to create a special edition soccer jersey and cleats. This partnership celebrated his Birmingham roots and the legacy of Black Sabbath, highlighting the intersection of music and sports. Beyond his musical career, Ozzy has been active in philanthropy. In October 2024, he joined over 1,000 writers and entertainers in signing an open letter opposing cultural boycotts of Israel, advocating for freedom of expression and against discriminatory practices. In summary, Ozzy Osbourne remains a dynamic figure, balancing personal health challenges with ongoing contributions to music, culture, and advocacy. His resilience and adaptability continue to inspire fans worldwide. What did you find most surprising or insightful about this deep dive into the life of Ozzy Osbourne? Share your thoughts by commenting below. If you enjoyed this video, we think you'll like one of these that's on your screen now. Also, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to the channel for more. Thanks for watching.